Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I am super excited. Today I received my Amazon designer dupes. So if you're interested in seeing what's inside, stick around. And don't forget, if you enjoy the video, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Thanks. Okay, well let's go ahead and get started. Normally I'm very, very happy with Amazon and their delivery. However, I want to show you the box that I received. Very smashed and not packaged very well, I don't believe. So I'm going to go ahead and open this. I will be right back. Okay, well the first thing we have is a Birkin dupe and it is brown crocodile and you know upon first glance it does seem like a nice bag the stitching is nice the hardware is very nice it does have a, a strap so if you want that okay and here is the inside of the bag it has some nice departments I mean it is very soft um, I think it'll hold up pretty well. I don't know if it's actual real leather because this is kind of a big bag and it was only $39, but it does have the nice little studs on the bottom. All in all, I mean, I think that's a great bag, especially for $39. $45,039. I think I'll take this one and if I wear it out in a year, $39. So, but it's very pretty and, uh, yeah, I'm very happy with it. So, on to the next thing. Now, the next thing I have, I'm super excited. I had a Chanel boy bag a few years ago, and unfortunately it was stolen. And I just said, I'm, there's no way I can afford to replace it, so, oh well. Well, they had a designer dupe on Amazon ah, for $29. And from the pictures, it looked pretty good. Okay, well, it comes with its own little dust bag for all practical purposes. And, oh my gosh, it is adorable. Wow, and it's pretty heavy. Feels very substantial. Let's see. There's the front of the bag. And the back. And it has the little clasp closure with the CC and it is a little stiff because it's a brand new bag <gasps> oh wow okay wow this is really nice hardware seems really nice and that's always a dead giveaway and the clasp works really cute but I mean that is adorable and for $29, I, I'm super impressed. Honestly, it feels a little more sturdy than, than the calfskin Chanel bag, which they're notorious for getting banged up on the corners here. I'm not sure what the material is. Oh my gosh, I've already got makeup on my new bag. Okay, there we go. But yeah, this is super cute. I like this. I'm gonna wear this. This will definitely be one of my, my new favorites. So moving right along, we have a Louis Vuitton wallet dupe. Ooh, well this is super cute. It actually feels very similar to the real wallet. Wow. The real wallet retails for $5.50, I believe. This I purchased, $16. So let's see the inside. And there's the inside of the wallet. Yeah, this is super cute. Now the only thing that we give this wallet away compared to the real one, in one of these little boxes, it would say an LV. So at a glance, I don't think anybody would ever know. And I, the hardware, even though it does not say Louis Vuitton on the um, zipper, the zipper is very nice. Like, it feels like a quality zipper. It doesn't, like, it's not jinky or anything like that. So this would be a definite designer dupe. Love, love, love this designer dupe. $16 versus $5.50. That you just can't compare. So in this bag, I honestly don't know what's in it. 
can't tell. So let's go ahead and open it. It's a bag within a bag. Well, at least they wrap it good. And yet another bag. <laughs> oh, these are Valentino flip-flops or Valentino replica flip-flops. Oh my gosh, these are super cute. Now, I saw the originals, and the originals are around $345 at Neiman Marcus, and I thought, there's no way I'm spending $345 for a pair of flip-flops. That's insane. So these do come with a little dust bag, and you know, they're, the look and feel of these flip-flops is pretty darn close to the real thing. So here's both of the shoes. And there's the sole, which the sole, I'm not sure if you can see, is very cute. It has a nice flowered pattern on the bottom. The one thing that I did like about these shoes is not only do they look just like the Valentino, the Valentino shoes have no outward markings so that you would know they were a real or a dupe except where the label is and your foot covers that so who really cares these were $16.99 I believe and um, yeah this is definitely a nice Valentino shoe dupe I am very happy with these I can't wait to wear them spring is right around the corner $16 versus $3.45 so let's see what other goodies we have and this is the last bag that I received. Oh, this is a Hermes bracelet dupe. And believe it or not, this little bracelet retails for $640 at Hermes. I bought this for 16 or 19, I can't really remember. So the bracelet opens by turning the little H. Oops, it's a little stiff and oops. And there you go. I did notice that they have several different sizes. This is a 6.3 inch, but they had six and a half, seven, and I think one other size. But I ordered the smallest because I have a really tiny wrist. And as you can see, this is not going anywhere. It won't, it won't fall off. And it has that really bougie Hermes style. So I really like this. This is awesome. And the last thing I have is a cashmere feel Burberry scarf, which I have to say is really super soft. It seems pretty well made. What I like about it is it is real. It's ridiculously soft. Let's just be a hundred percent. This thing is super soft and it was only $16.99. I believe the one on Burberry is around $350. $350 versus $16.99. Once again, you know, if you're out and about wearing this, I don't think anybody would say, oh, that's not a Burberry. The pattern is identical. The, the little fringe is very similar. And uh, it's a great little scarf. Well, that wraps up our designer dupes. Hope you've enjoyed the video. I've enjoyed checking them all out. I think it's... Uh, it's just amazing to me that things that cost thousands of dollars, you can find a replica for one-tenth, one-fiftieth of the price, and it looks identical. So, you know, if you're just going for style, then who cares if it actually has the designer name on it? And as always, you spend your money however you want. I'm not saying to buy these, buy the real. I, you do what you want with your money. I just think it's fun to order things and kind of see the quality compared to the originals. And since there's so many stores in my area that I can go and touch and feel and see these items, you know, it's, it's pretty cool to see that the dupes don't look much different and feel much different. So I hope you've enjoyed the video. Have a great day. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.